Hello, hi. All right, let's, uh, is this the button that I press? No, look at that crazy camera situation. Let's fix that real fast. Hey, that's much better. All right, hi, I'm Ned. Uh, you might know me, you might not know me. I'm an actor, producer, writer, composer. Not a composer, why did I say that? It's because I'm looking for composers. My most recent tweet that isn't about this stream is I'm looking to build my Rolodex of composers. Are you a composer? Send me your information. It's specifically for scoring podcasts, fiction podcasts, things of that nature. Um, I'm streaming Wildermyth, and the other night I discovered I think I'm in the final battle from completing this campaign. If that's true, what's going to happen is I'm going to go beat it, and then I'm going to end the stream and take a little break, like three minutes, and then I'm going to launch a new stream where we're going to start a new campaign, and all of that is for the sake of VOD. Um, you know, uh, uh, I think we just get right to it. Yeah, let's go! All right, play. Uh, continue story. And we'll do a no sidebar. Yeah, that's the look we want. Okay, so we're in. So, so this can this chapter might be longer than just this, but I think we've discovered the entire world except for this final piece, which is why I think I might be about to beat it. Now, there may be a second objective that does tend to happen in this game. Um. Okay, these guys are doing a thing. Meanwhile, you guys should go find an item. Yeah. You do that. Actually, do I want to send... It would be Grenivia. Because I have one or two fighters over here. Yeah, it would be... It would be Grenivia. Um... Q. And let's... I think I need another fighter. So let's go. Okay, what do we find over here? Hides and fabrics? That's okay, I have a lot of those. Melee and ranged accuracy. Let's give it to Grenivia. We're sending her over, she's got a wolf head. Seems right. Um, I'm gonna have these guys go prepare a defense. And we'll do a, a tier one and then see where we're at with this four. All right, in we go. Who's tweeting at me? Oh, understood. So, the time has come. I never remember the voices. For this next campaign, I'm gonna write down voices so that I can try and be consistent between streams. But here we go. The time has come. When we draw strength from our bonds, and scrape this curse off of our land for good. Blades and wits sharp, ready yourselves. Oh, just so many things. Are they letting me like actually gear up? Oh, dang. Also, this is taking a second to load. Let's just let it populate. The computer is unhappy. Or the game is unhappy, and we're just going to give it a second to figure itself out. So in the meantime, you know, I don't know that there's anyone here, but if there are, how you doing? How's life? I hope it's good, because, uh, dang. Multiple messages, that's exciting. Okay. Um, are we up? Alright, we seem to be up. So... I got a lot of things to spend and spend them I should. So, let's max out everybody. You should have a third level staff. Great. Create. You should have a third level hammer. Craft. Create. You should have a third level Will it lose the water? No, it keeps it. Great. Uh, you have top... Everyone seems to have top armor. 
Uh, there's nothing offhand that I can do for either of you. You already have hurlaxes. You don't have an arm. I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we've. I think we're as ready as we can get here. Okay. So, what do we got here? I had been prepared to pay a price for the form I took. A price of flesh and breath. But it cost more than that. It cost peace. It cost the person I loved most. Though Emma and I never spoke again. Perhaps the rest of this can still be put right. In the days when the flood of Morthagy had slowed to a trickle, Oryun was able to locate openings in the cliffs. I've, s I've seen a lot of things in my life, but this is a whole new manner of thing. Listen, I have to get something important to get off my chest in case we don't make it. I'm the one who's been stealing your jerky. <sighs> oh, Glenn, I knew. With stone and iron and bone closing in, it can feel unlucky to be made of softer things. That was a great cutoff musically. I loved it. But we have strength of our own which should not be underestimated. Here we go. This is gonna be messy. There's multiple wardrobes. There's a wardrobe right in front of us. So let's just start. Grenivia. You can only get to here? Uh, that's not good. Glenn, how far can you get? You also can only get to here. Um, okay. Um, if I do a cone of fire, it will hit Glenn? No, I can do it this way. Great. And now it's in fire, so it'll die. Let's get her up here for the sake of safety. We'll leave everyone else in the background. Uh, so you'll wait, and Melius will shoot. All right. Let's play the game. Stalwart. Guard. Glenn, you're next. Ugh. Let's get you here, but you're not guarding. Okay. Let's put... Um, we'll put... There's no one else to see yet. So let's put him here. And he can take a shot. Got him. Let's put her here. That'll re-inspire people. And then let's put him here. Ooh, I don't like hallway battle. That's for sure. Oh, man. That's a lot of bad guys. Okay. Guard. All right, Glenn. You're next. Glenn, I need you to get right next to her. I need you to stalwart. And I need you to guard. Now we're just forming a wall. Um, we'll put him behind, because he can be. Is he still inspired? He is. So we're going to take a shot, which hopefully is going to take out that Somalia. It is. Jambia, let's get you into position. There is nothing to interfuse with, so you're just hanging out and inspiring people. Let's get you into position. 
And you are also gonna shoot the coachman. Great. Oh my god, there's so many of them. We're just gonna move forward one. Alright, Somalia is down. Glenn, I'm gonna move you forward two. And guard? Oryun? We're gonna move you here. And what can you hit? Alright, let's try it. They both blocked it. It's a bummer news. John Via, if there's still nothing to interfuse with, we're just gonna step you forward one. And you're gonna wait. Melius, you're gonna complete my arc. <sighs> let's get an axe in to try and get the axe can only hit the spectic. Not worth it. Ugh, everyone's dodging. Alright, Glenn. That's not good. That's not good. That's really not good. Okay. Um, I need everyone to move forward, I think. And in order to do that, some people are going to have to stay in acid. So I think I need everyone to actually move backwards, which is fine. Um, we'll do it by moving Oryun first. He'll just move back one, and he's going to cone of fire this dude. Wow, really? Great. Coachman's dead. Which means I can move John via back here. Yeah, that's fine. I can move Melius back here where he can till the spectic and I can move Glenn back here where he can guard great okay so how do I solve this problem I think I have to disable stalwart get him up here He's going to guard. And I'm going to put, not Janvia, but Grenivia right behind him as like a double up, still stalwarting. Oh, can bite. Maybe kill the Spectic. Great. And then she is going to... Her reach has it, so she should guard. Janvia, let's get you into place right here. Still nothing to interfuse, so you're just on inspiring world. Let's get you back here, and let's kill this guy. Great, great. Let's have you step up. I don't think Cone of Fire... There's no way to Cone of Fire without hurting my own team, so... And I could do that, but I think this is going to be more effective. Got him. We're gonna wait a turn and let this acid go away. Guard. Done. Done. Guard. Done. Okay. Renevia. Disable stalwart. How far can you get? Let's get you there. What can you see? Nothing? Ooh, guard. Glenn, how far can you get? Um, Glenn can get into position, so that's what we're going to do. And we're going to guard. Oryun. Well, let's start with John Via. How far can you get? That's fine.
Just in case, let's grab that. And then be done. Melius, let's get you into position. And then Oryun, I don't know why you're moving so slow. I think it's because you're old, to be honest with you. Let's get her up here. What do we see? Anything? That better not be more. Oh, wait! Oh, wait! It's you! We promised aid after all you had done for us. And we keep promises. Talila sends her regards. Oh my god, I forgot about the sacrifice of Talila. Okay, well, let's guard up. Glenn, let's get you up here. And let's guard up. Uh, let's go through these one at a time. Lynn, you don't offer my bonuses, so I'm putting you in front, because why not? Guard. Oh, you have the ability to guard? That's very good news. What do these guys do? They can just attack? Let's get them in the front line, then. John via get into position here and withdraw done Melius let's get you into position here and you're done Oryun man Oryun you are ready to retire my friend okay well Grenivia keep marching forward. I think this is worth it. Well, it wasn't worth it. Oh, it just launched a door. Okay. Glenn, get up here. I wish I could move the whole party and just, like, say, everyone move forward in the same formation. Oryun was right behind him, so that's where he's gonna be. This bellhop. We'll actually inspire this bellhop. This bellhop, we will... will end up being inspired. John Via comes right back into her old stomping grounds. You get up here. Melius comes up here. Okay, the real question is, can the bellhops open the doors? So let's get them in front of the door. As Oryun reached for the door, its eyes snapped onto him and it groaned open by itself. Oh dear. It could be debated whether the heaving, multi-part construction before them was alive, but it wouldn't matter. Life was a quaint concept in this place. Morthagy core. Lesser core. Inside its glass chambers, an infernal stew of bones. Great. Oh, God. Oh, wow. It really didn't let me pick my own shot. That's so frustrating. Okay, what can I do? What can I do? First and foremost, Oryun's going to have to do a thing. So let's back John Via up. She should not be in the front row. Let's back her up, <clears throat> which will give me space. Now, interfuse with... What does this do? Bone Lance. <clears throat> yeah, we're in a Bone Lance. Okay, that's a good start. 
Um, we're gonna have Glenn move into that space. Stalwart. And guard. Oryun, I should have had him throw the cone shot before Glenn got there. That's a mistake. So let's throw, first throw Quelling Moss. Then let's take a through shot at the wardrobe. Got him. Great. Great. Oh, I got another one? Let's just take a second shot then. Wardrobe's gone. That's huge news. All right. So now this bellhop. This bellhop should back up. I need it. Grenivia up front. Grenivia, get into this space. Let's start with a bite and see if you can take someone off the board. Because if so, I'm moving a bellhop up into it. Great. Then we're going to guard. He'll die on his turn, he'll die on his turn. Shoot this guy. Got him. All right, this is a good start. This is a great start. Oh man, the Morthagi core has an acid jet. That's not what you like to see. So there's another workshop back there. Wardrobe, I mean. Okay. Glenn, disable your stalwart and get in here. How far can you get? Is that a worth it number? I think so. Oryun, this is a really good time to go shoot some stuff. Let's get you in here. Let's shoot some stuff. Nevia. Let's get this bellhop first. Okay. What can she interfuse with that's going to do something good for me here? She could bone lance. That's the answer. Is there a way to hit both of these? Let's kill the nurse. I don't know what it is, so it's great. Feels like it just revives that. Lynn? That's fine.
Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, God, the acid jet's really going to be a problem. And he's going to do it, too. Okay. Glenn, let's get you up here. We need to take down this core now. Uh, let's actually go to Grenivia. Get up here. That's annoying. She should have just walked left. Please don't explode in acid. Okay. Got it. Great, 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 great. All right. Hey, Gary Tron. Uh, yeah, I mean, at some point, I need someone to, like, teach me how to set up Nightbot best. Or someday, maybe I'll have moderators of my own. But for now, it's just me. And this is the final battle of this campaign. And it's very hard. And then I'm going to start a new campaign. So I'm actually going to end the stream for, like, three minutes and then start anew with a new, uh, campaign. Fresh. because uh, the other night I had to close up a little too early. Oh, he stunted. Well, that's so interesting. Can he hit anything? Great. Let's hit this guy. Poison that thing. Okay, what do we got? What are we dealing with? Yeah, 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 yeah. Lynn's gonna die, and that's okay. Oh, these things make... Ugh. Ugh. At least the acid jet seems to be gone. Okay, so I think we can run for this lesser core that has no damage because and we'll wait to do that glenn let's get you in here stalwart take this off the board okay um uh gary tron what what was the word you spammed by the way i forgot to ask uh Stalwart, but she's gonna actually attack this thing. Okay. can this do? Shackles aren't that useful. Bone lances are. Come on. Kill it. Got it. Great. Come on, Lynn. When he reappears, I'll want him to be protecting. Okay. 
Did I stun? No. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, God. So let's start with Lynn. Who's going to kill this groundskeeper? Now let's go to Glenn. He's going to come up here. And whack it. And then let's go to Grenivia. He's going to come up next to, to Glenn and try and kill it. Got it. All right, what does this do for me? That's it. Is that the end of the uh, campaign? The walk back out was darker. But the ceilings didn't collapse on us. And without their maddened voice to call them, the things that were once more Theji fell still and silent. Some were burned. Some were buried. A few were repurposed. So, so uh, what are you going to do now, then? The yonderling lands are a bit sour on the mechanical folk at the moment. It would be wise to lay low. What's another few hundred years after all? The end. All right. The Enduring War, complete. He also tried weaving with Thrixel silk at best dream loom. He would have wasted away at the loom if Grenivia hadn't found him and pulled him away. Kayaso was less keen than some to spend evenings reliving the old days. I specifically fought Morthagy so we wouldn't have to talk about them all the time anymore. Oh, he's back? How's that possible? Also, how's Janvia back? Or is this just like a flashback? Business boomed at Flamrill Quarry when Three Worms built a new tower near its center. Glenn would come for loads of stone and tell the Quarry Master stories from his favorite fights. Oh, hi, Jennifer Ann. Welcome to the uh, chat. John Via developed a passion for restoring ruined sites. They may not have quite matched their former glory, but she hoped the former inhabitants wouldn't be too embarrassed. Jamin showed up one day as the god of tick bites. I know you don't want to ask. Don't. How did just don't? So yeah, it's like a collection of memories and uh, wrap up. Melius gathered as many of the company stories as he could and enlisted John Via to illustrate them. <laughs> I remember that one. Nicely done. Agareth spent many a happy night in the tavern, enthralling the men with tales of her exploits. And that rumor about their unbreakable bones? Totally false. One day, Grenivia awoke with a lightness in her step. I understand now. It all makes sense. She vanished for ten years and returned somehow unaged and full of sorrow. That's a bummer. Orion built a lodge that attracted like-minded hunting enthusiasts. Days were spent tracking in the woods, and night were spent exaggerating what they had tracked in the woods. Ah, they were so young. That's the funness of it. Like, watching them age is really a fun part of this game.
Tallulah Broadmouth was already in Legacy. Oh, as a folk hero because she sacrificed herself. Yeah, I, I don't need to add Melly. I don't need to add people. Yeah, I mean, why not, right? I can always probably remove them later. Okay. So, I feel like Orion should get promoted and Talila should get promoted. They were there from the beginning. And they made it. I mean, Nolof retired. But I think, I think we're going to promote Talila because she sacrificed herself. And we're going to promote Orion. Oh, I have, I have two more. Well, then it's going to be Jonvia. Grenivia was there at the end. Nolof got old. Um, I think I'm going to give it to Nolof as the OG. The elemental weapons you discovered this game have been unlocked and your legacy will now be able to craft in all future games. Awesome! I didn't know that's a thing. All right, everybody. So I'm going to end this stream, take like two minutes, and then launch a new stream uh, to kick off the new game. So uh, we'll talk to everyone in just a couple minutes. Uh, yeah. Goodbye.